Hey guys, welcome to Sherry to Sherry, and today we're going to be making steak and creamy mushroom gravy in the Instapot. What we're going to need is your um, steaks, you can do like two to four pounds. We're going to need Worcester sauce, a Ziploc bag, onion powder, garlic powder, two uh, cans of healthy creamy mushroom soup, one jar of mushrooms, I got those at Dollar Tree, vegetable broth, and a little salt and pepper. For the marinade in the Ziploc bag with the steak in it, add a cup of Worcester sauce, about a fourth a teaspoon of salt, a fourth a teaspoon of pepper. Zip it up, leave it for 30 minutes or overnight. I did mine overnight, so once it's marinated, let's get started. It's going to be really tender and flavorful from the marinade. So get your Ziploc bag with the steak and marinade in it. Put it in the Instapot. You'll want to take your fork and move the steaks around in the bottom of the Instapot to get it pretty even and level as best you can. You can use two to three teaspoons of onion powder, but I use two. Now you add in the tablespoon of garlic. That's to your taste. Use less if you don't like as much. You need to add one jar of the mushrooms from the Dollar Tree, and they need to be drained. And this is a quick view from the top. So the next item we're going to be adding is this healthy mushroom gravy that I got. I'm using two cans, so try to dump it in there. And if it's not coming out really well, just grab your spatula and scoop it all out into the Instapot on top of the steaks. After you get the gravy in, take your spatula and smooth it over the steaks. And this is where you're going to add the vegetable broth. And it's um, one to two cups. I use two cups. You could replace it with beef broth or water and as you see here I'm pouring it down the side of the Instapot to go into the bottom so it doesn't wash away the gravy and seasoning. Place the lid on the Instapot, put it on seal and now you're ready. Press the manual button or the pressure cook button and you want to use the adjust buttons to set it for 25 minutes. It's time to open the Instapot and see what we've got here. It smells so good watch out for that steam when opening. Here is a good view for you. So I'm gonna stir it up really well, make sure nothing's sticking on the bottom and just get it mixed up really well before um, we do a uh, plating. So this Uncle Ben's uh, whole grain wild rice melody is great. You tear the little corner, you pop it in the microwave and in 90 seconds you have a side. Thanks for watching this today. I hope you try it for your family. And if you do four pounds or more of steak, I would add two cans of gravy. Please like, subscribe, and share.